Hi guys, I'm Gemma Smith and today I'm here with David Unger from Ocean Beach Surf Life Saving Club who is also the Director of Surf Sports for Surf Life Savings in Central Coast and today we're just having a bit of a chat to get to know him a little bit better. Okay Dave, so how long have you been involved in Surf Life Saving? Been in surf for approximately 30 years, or 32, 33 years. Oh wow, so have you been in Ocean Beach Surf Life Saving Club the whole time? Yes. Yes? And what are some of your earliest memories? Um, and my earliest memories for starting is I, I'm a parent of a, of a nipper and uh, we started um, back then, my wife and I, with three kids and um, started from there. Next minute I'm the um, junior JAC chairman and then uh, then president. So it's uh, it's been an interesting ride. Yeah, that's for sure. So you're currently the director of surf sports at South Life Saving Central Coast yes. and you've obviously hinted that you've grown up and taken on a few other roles. What roles have you taken on in South Life Saving? Um, I'm an, a senior official and the, uh, I do major carnivals for Australia and New South Wales and also for all the um, uh, branch, branch carnivals. But um, I've also um, been a selector for the branch. Um, just most things that branches do, um, club, club land, president, um, and everything in the club from com different committees and things. Yeah. Very good. So what made you decide to take on the Director of Surf Sports for Surf Life Saving Central Coast? I think it was a, just a, a natural fit because I was still an official and doing all the carnivals and I was also the uh, manager of special events in them days and then um, when the previous director decided that uh, he'd finished his, um, his time, um, I was asked to do it and I just put my hand up and went from there. Yeah, yeah for sure. So over time, surf life saving has definitely evolved and changed. Um, what are some of the changes that you've been able to see over time? I've seen in, in surf sports, I've seen a, a major change from um, programs that have been brought out uh, through Australia and New South Wales, um, which we've been implemented in branch, <coughs> which gives us um, the competitor the opportunity to go from high level or to particip participation. Um, just basically it's up to the individual which way they want to go. So, but there's plenty of scope out there now. Yeah. And I've seen many, many changes in that area. Yeah, wow. It definitely would have been amazing to see, I'm sure. Oh, it would be. <laughs> it is. Yeah. Um, so apart from you definitely sounded like you've had a really long journey over in surf life saving, what do you do besides um, being down here and involved? Basically, it's surf. Yeah. I've got two grandkids now that do nippers. Um, we, we, we come down to nippers with them and do a few carnivals, but, but Elaine and I are both fully um, active in carnivals. Uh, Elaine's the, been a director here, director on the board here for 22 years, so everything revolves around surf. That's all we do. <laughs> yes, we all love it, I'm sure. <laughs> That's all we do. There's yes. nothing out there. There's nothing I do. Yeah, there's nothing I do outside, basically. Oh, wow. So, um... One of the biggest challenges in surf life saving, as you've mentioned, is sort of maintaining officials. And you've hinted that you've definitely been involved in officiating as, as your wife has as well. What are some of the things that Surf Life Saving Central Coast is trying to do to maintain this official base? Trying to support them. Um, it's, it's difficult because uh, a lot of uh, clubs need to have officials in order for them to have carnivals. Um, and the only way that we can do it is make sure that the education with the officials is up to date streamline for them and just support them um, but that's 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 what we do it's it's a it's a major thing but it's it's something that it's important for the uh, for our members uh, we, we need to keep them um, the biggest problem is trying to keep our officials yeah. uh, once they finish their members uh, if we can get them into um, senior ranks that's 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 what we want to do yeah for sure so one of the challenges is keeping officials, but also what are we trying to do on the Central Coast to help build surf sports and keep sort of athletes going? Well, we've had, um, in the last couple of years, we've had a couple of programs that we're putting in place. Uh, one is the development program and the other one is the pool, uh, cheer, pool program. Those two programs uh, we're looking at seriously. Um, the pool program, which is just an extension of what we did last year, um, which is working well the world to just support those competitors. But the surf sports development program is going to be, be centred around coaches 
and working with coaches in clubs to bring them through. So we can bring, if we can bring them up through the ranks the, to support their competitors in their own club, um, I think we're going to go a long way to supporting the branch and um, implementing more programs so we can get our interbreed side moving in a, yeah. a better a better fashion or moving yes. forward. So there's a lot there's a, there's been a lot going on, and I'm sure there's going to be a lot more going on too. Uh, but we just need the support from the coaches and the clubs yeah. to make sure that we maintain a good level of um, coaching for for our competitors. For sure. So it sounds like there's some exciting things ahead for South Coast. I think so, yes, I think so. And um, there's a lot of good people out there that are helping the branch put things together. Um, the, and I, I can only see better times coming. Yeah, for sure. So just on behalf of, um, as an athlete on the Central Coast, just thank you for your contribution and hopefully moving forward there'll be better things to come. Well, I think, yes, so, and that's good. I mean, we've got some great athletes members in, in in the branch um, and we've got to support them um, from yourself to the high level down to the participation we've got to support the whole thing and there's a lot of work going on in the background to try and um, implement these sort of strategies so, yeah. Yeah. For sure. no thank you for the chat no worries